des questions. Bien. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the medal winner's ceremony for the small medals short program of the ISU World Figure Skating Championships 2022, Montpellier, France. ISU Small Medals Award category pairs, short program. Third, and winners of the ISU Small Bronze Medal, Riko Miura Ruichi Kihara, Japan. Second, and winners of the ISU Small Silver Medal, Ashley Kane Gribble, Timothy Leduc, United States of America. First, and winners of the ISU Small Gold Medal in men, uh, Pairs Short Program, Alexa Kinirim, Brandon Fraser, United States of America. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. And again, con congratulations to the medalists. we we'll give them a big hand. So thank you for attending this press conference of the pair short program. First of all, do we need a French translation or not? Okay, thank you. Congratulations to all three teams. We'll start with the gold medal. Alexa and Brandon, I have just one small question for you. Is the goal here to do as good as your coach, who was silver medalist in 1998 or even better? Wow, congrats, Todd. <laughs> hmm. I think whatever our personal best may be will be enough to make him proud and us proud. So we'll see what happens. OK. What about <laughs> your performance of tonight? I know it was a joke, but I, need to, I had to do it. <laughs> Thank you. Um, performance of tonight. Yeah, uh, Alexa and I were um, just very proud of what we put out. We put out a personal best. And we're just, every time we come out and compete, we're trying to grow. Um, and grow these programs. So it was a great way to finish this short program off for the season and uh, just very proud and happy for us. Ashley and uh, Timothy, your comments about tonight's performance. Uh, we're super excited with our performance, I'm super excited with our position right now and super excited about US pairs. This is a really awesome result to see and we're excited for the future as well. <laughs> 
And I guess you know that the last time the US won the pair world medals champions was in 1979. Wow. Did you know that? So it's kind of a pressure on your shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> And a comment from yeah. the Japanese, I think it's working, the translation, I don't see that, but is it working? Yes, it is. Thank you very much, Tomoko. <laughs> so you can speak in Japanese and we'll have a translation. <laughs> Apologies, can you repeat the question? General comment about your performance of tonight. <笑>今日の演技に関する感想をお願いいたします。そうですね、あの大きなミスを一つしてしまったりレベルの取りこぼしがあったんですけど、その中で今日目標としていたあの二人とも笑顔で終わるということを達成できたので、それは本当に良か
、えー、メダルが見えてくると思います。そういう意味ではすごく緊迫感が高まったりとか、もしくはトレーニングにより励むことができたなど、何かそこでの影響があったかを教えてください。僕たちのテーマが毎試合毎試合その過去の自分たちに勝つっていうことをテーマにやってきていたので特にそのどの国が出場してくる来ないっていうのはあまり関係なかったですしそれによってなんだろう練習に急に熱が入ったりっていうのはなくて逆にリラックスしていたかなっていうふうに思いますオリンピックがものすごい大きな山場だったのでそれを超えた後だったのでとにかく常にリラックスしていたかなというふうに思います。For us, the theme has always been to beat ourselves from the past,、uh, beat our own performance from the past. So, for us, it really doesn't matter which country is taking part or not. I think it was really more about us. Being able to relax. I don't think we felt any more tension about having to train harder, especially because we had come out of the Olympics and that was the biggest peak for us. So, since then, I think we were able to always think about skating with a relaxed mindset. Thank you, Tomoko. By the way, it's 5 a.m. in Tokyo, so thank you so much for being awake. Thank you so much. Yes, Jackie. On,、uh... Ashley, last time we saw you in the Olympics, you had an injury during practice and you know, you've gutted it out at the Olympics. How's it been since then? It's been good. It was obviously really frustrating to have that happen, especially after we had been there for so long and we've been training really consistently. And so for that to happen right before the short program, it was. Really frustrating, but you try to focus on what you can control and getting the most out of the experience. And luckily, we had a really great team there that helped me rehab it right away. And when I got home, it was straight into rehabbing it as well and just continued to do that so that I could be 100% here. And I feel like I am. Next question. Yes, Jean Christophe, up to you. <laughs> Merci, Selina.、Uh, yeah,、uh, if, if I may ask you.、Uh, For the Japanese skaters, Tomoko. <laughs> oh, yes, okay. Thank you, Tomoko.、Um, you have the best component scores tonight. And it's a surprise to me, excuse me. And yet, after seeing you, I thought you had the right component scores. So, how do you. Work on this and to make it something special above your elements. Hi, Nihon no pair ni, Stimon or Shimas. Eh, Honjit wa of Tari no components no score ga itchiban takai desu. De, ano, sumimasen, sore wa watashimos koshi odoroi te irun desu ga, demo honto ni, minasan no engi o mite na toku o s t e m a s でははいかにしてお二人はエレメンツ以上の、えー、非常に特別なものにこれを仕上げていらっしゃるんですかどのように達成していますか、えっと、僕もそれはあの驚きました僕自身もその PCS が一番だったってことは僕たちもあのびっくりしました、えっと、正直なんだろう特別なことはあの取り組んでいないんですけどもとにかくその常にあのポジティブに前回の自分たちに勝てるようにっていうことを常に2人で心がけてやってきているのであとはあの詳しいことはそこに座っているブルーノに聞いてください。<笑> so I would like to say that we are I'm also surprised that we had the best program component score and The thing is, I don't think we do anything really special. The point is, we always try to stay positive, and we're both serious about being better than our previous performance. So that's really it. And for more details, you can talk to Bruno, who is sitting right there. 
Would you like to talk, Bruno? <laughs> <laughs> we can have a, a, a microphone, Bruno. You can raise, please. At least it's interactive. Come up, come, come here, come here. <laughs> English, Francais? In English? All right. Anyway, first of all, I want to say congratulations to all the teams, and that was a great show. And I know coming back from the Olympics from such a peak and only having two weeks to come down and to see these performance, come on, hand of applause to all of these guys. They were unbelievable. <laughs> and I don't care who's here, who's not here. These were all winning performances, no matter who is here. Um, <laughs> answering your question, it's a tricky one. Uh, <laughs> I, I think, I think the, um, I think they have really strong skating skills, and I think they're too humble. I do think that they have something extremely special, and what you see is real. The connection between the two is something very natural. Uh, it's a reflection of their amazing relationship. Um, I think these guys, they come to the rink and they just want to be better than the day before. And they love to learn. They, they, they're a great, um, unbelievable student. And I think the, um, the reflection of their performance is, is from their hard work. And it's really a result of their passion that they have for the sport. And, and all my years of skating is I mean, I've, I'm very privileged to have world champion in the past, and they have the exact same thing in common, is they love what they do, and they just, f they really focus on themselves and not other people. Thank you, Bruno. I didn't, I didn't preview that, Bruno. <laughs> Next question, yes, in the far end. Can you raise your hand so we can see? Okay. There you are. A question to Riku and Ryuichi. Mira Senshu, Kiara Senshu, and someone else. Throughout the season, uh, in the interviews during the competitions, you use the word enjoy. For example, you know, the today I couldn't enjoy your uh, performance, or tomorrow, I just want to focus on enjoy our performance. And I, I'm just wondering, um, what do you need to have if you want to enjoy your performance? Consistent toast, the, uh, you know, you can't tell me that you are not going to be able to do it. But I'm going to be able to do it. But I'm going to be able to do it. And I'm going to be able to do it. And I'm going to be able to do it. その時、ものすごく苦労していて、その時にあの世界選手権だったりグランプリシリーズっていうものをあの出場させていただいていたんですけれども、いつかこうやって上手い人たちと同じグループで滑りたいなっていうふうにこの横にいる二組ともいつか
Last question, yes, Akiko. Um, this is just a quick question to all the teams. Every skaters were talking about how difficult is it to regroup from the Olympics. And I just wanted to know, especially the pair was the last event in Beijing. Uh, what was the most difficult thing preparing for this competition? Was it mental or physical or, you know, you could just talk about that? We start with... Um, <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a little of both. A little mental, a little physical. Um, you know, the Olympics is... It's, it's such a high level, exciting level for every athlete there. Um, it was my first time experience it. But at the end of the day, you, uh, you just, it's a process. Take a couple days, regroup, and work together. And everything starts rebuilding for the next event. Um, being completely honest, it was really hard. Yeah. <laughs> Mentally, physically, um, you reached the point that you had always wanted to reach. And, you know, for us, that was the Olympic Games. It was the national championships. And um, we just had to allow ourselves to come down and be able to peak at the right time. And, you know, somebody told me that, you know, you don't have to be like, killing yourself in the rink every day. You don't have to be overtraining. You're at a point in the season where your body just knows what it needs to do. And I think that that's what we really focused on on the weeks coming in was just that, was just going on autopilot, making sure that we just stayed conditioned and that we were in a positive mind frame so that when we got here, we were just ready to go. Yeah, and also being each other's cheerleader yeah. and taking, taking time to give each other space to feel what we needed to feel on the days when it was like, mental is not there, body not there, um, and just like voice that to each other, give each other space and, and take turns holding each other up. <laughs> it's yeah. a tough turnaround, but um, regardless, we're really, really well trained and really excited to be here. Yeah, we're so honored to be here. This is such an amazing opportunity and we really focused on that. And you just trust in the team around you that when you're feeling your weakest, they are there to hold you up. And that's what we did. And um, they helped us get here. お二人にとってメンタルとフィジカルどちらの準備が大変でしたかそうですねあのオリンピックから帰ってきた 練習は昨日より今日、今日より明日っていう風に少しずつ、あの、良くなっていっていたので、あの、なんだろう、まあ、メンタルも、あの、身体的にも、あの、どんなんだろう、少しずつ少しずつ良くなってきたかなって感じです